All right, hi guys, this is Greg, Underground Graphics. Uh, we're gonna do a quick install today. This is gonna be our first vinyl product for our Bronco. Uh, we're gonna be doing that hood insert. Um, that's gonna help with that sun glare. Uh, this one's just gonna be solid matte black. We'll eventually start putting some designs and some patterns in these. Uh, these are printed on, or cut on 3M, uh, 2080 wrap film, masked with air mask. This is gonna be the, one of the easiest installs um, to do. Um, these are already cut uh, you know, to fit. Um, the only thing you're gonna need, uh, clean the hood, make sure you install this on a cool, dry hood. Don't do this out in the sun, don't do it when the car's hot. Um, obviously we're inside um, 72 degrees in here, I believe. Um, but you're gonna need some alcohol just to prep the surface. Um, we, we, we do an alcohol water mix. Uh, squeegee, which will, will be provided. Remember, hard squeegee's fine on the mask, but if you're gonna go onto the vinyl itself, make sure you wrap a microfiber around that edge. Uh, masking tape and a pair of scissors. Um, you really don't even need a ruler for this. Again, this is already cut to shape. Uh, you wanna have, I've got a little bit of paint showing, about a sixteenth of an inch to an eighth. Um, you can kind of position this yourself to make sure you got it where you want it. Both sides. Um, again, this, this turned out great. Um, so a couple pieces of masking tape just to hold that in place as we get this started. All I have to do one piece one side, one side just try to match that same gap you had. We're gonna go, this is just gonna be a hinge method. I've got a little step stool. If you got the steel bumper, you can step on that. This is gonna be kind of an awkward install. These hoods are never comfortable. And I've, actually, I've already done the alcohol on this, but I wanted to show you guys what we're, what we're using. I'm not sure you can see what I'm doing here, but that tape, I'm just gonna break that seal. That way we can see where that's gonna line back up at. Make sure your hands are clean when you do this. If you touch that vinyl, anything on your hand, even grease, but the slightest bit of dirt will show in there. Um, so you gotta make sure that's, that, that's clean. Really lay this, it's not gonna tack immediately, but you can come back, check that spot, and that's it. Typically on this wrap film, once you've applied it, you wanna go back and you wanna post paint that. Magic numbers, 180. Um, really, this being such a flat surface, make sure you get lots of pressure on this. It's down. If you have a heat gun, great. Just go over, make sure there's no bubbles in it. Um, we really just use that heat for complex curves. If something does come up, let that let that cool before you push that back down. Remove those two pieces of hinge tape. It's good. A little tricky. I'm gonna get that ladder back around. Overlapping strokes. Now we can remove that mask. All right, if you have any questions, give us a call.